Okay, uh, and with regard to the issue of uh, retired Lieutenant Piki's disappearance, um, I can confirm that uh, by yesterday, uh, Lieutenant Piki had found his way home, uh, having uh, managed to use his military skills to escape the abductors uh, somewhere when he was around uh, Chino, uh, Mazoe Bridge, according to his testimony. So by yesterday, he was actually in Harare, and he actually sought audience uh, with the commission, which was uh, not granted. Because by the time he got to the venue of the commission where he's sitting at Cresta, it was uh, during the time when I think Obed Mpof was testifying, then followed by uh, um, another witness. But uh, the secretariat kept on saying they were going to go back to, to the legal team that was seeking audience that he would be allowed to testify since he had been scheduled to testify. Actually, before even yesterday, letters had been returned to the commission indicating the circumstances surrounding his absence uh, to testify on the scheduled time and date. And uh, that letter was simply indicated as received. So when the lawyers go, went back again to say, now this is the status quo and seeking audience before the commission that was not uh, received positively. And uh, while the negotiations were happening to seek audience, uh, the machinery and everything, the recording pieces were just uh, packed into their boxes. So by yesterday, just before the announcement that they had finished taking the evidence, um, retired Lieutenant Piki was actually also at Cresta trying to seek audience with the commission. So, but the problem is his security still remains a priority issue uh, considering what he went through because he was not released by free will. He managed to escape his abductees. Is he injured? Um, I think issues uh, of injuries, uh, he is still in the hands of, uh, uh, he has been referred to, 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 to the doctors who can confirm whether he's injured or so, but as far as he was uh, narrating his audio, uh, he was subjected to torture, which needs to be verified also by medical evidence. Did he confirm who was captured? Oh, that one is, yeah, he confirms that he was captured. That is confirmed. I mean, he doesn't know because they were, they were wearing masks. He doesn't even know his abductees, although he can confirm that he was really abducted. That's, that's what he confirms. Maybe let me just take a round of other questions. If it's another follow-up to the answer to this, then I'll also give opportunity to others who may